guys, it's Joe back at gaming here with the um Fallout 4 any mod I mean well any mod any weapon glitch. I mean there's an actual mod for it, it's just not on PlayStation yet, so let's let's get right into this. Let me just go upstairs now. So what you wanna do is you wanna have two guns that you wanna modify of course. Now I got a couple set up of guns that I want to modify. First we have the um, muzzled advanced double wheel shotgun and the combat rifle. Now what you want to do for the first weapon is you want to put A on it. And then put B. It doesn't matter if it's uppercase or lowercase, it's still do the same thing. But the one at the top, all the mods for like this gun are going on this gun. So whatever is on the top, all the mods from there goes down. So that's how it works. But what you want to do is you want to, once you have them named, you want to get out of it. And quick save. So just in case of any mess ups. And you want to click square and X at the same time. But if you want to get the barrel for the gun, you want to put this barrel on the shotgun. Then you would click square and X and the D-pad down same time so first we're just gonna click square and X and I got it right you can see how it went to the mod menu but you can see scrap so now click scrap it should oh <coughs> whenever that pops up that means you that means it messed up itself so you're gonna have to go back to that save you did and that's kind of why you saved because stuff like that happens And then you want to try it again. We still got the screw box. So sometimes that might happen because you have the. If you can change the name of it. Like now I want to do it uppercase. Just to see if that works. And then we're going to try it again. There we go, now we got it. So now if I click advanced, boom. Alright, there's the rifle thing for the shotgun. So I want to get on my automatic. Um, I want to have the long barrel, keep the long barrel, why not? Um, I obviously, I don't have no glass or no nuclear material. I'm upset about that. So let's, let's just keep it how it is. Let's go get some shotgun shells and see how it shoots. Stood there for like six seconds. Shotgun shells. And my PlayStation is actually being really loud for no apparent reason. Uh, let's see how it shoots. It's two bullets. Will it be instantly or slow? Who knows? So it shoots two shotgun shells instantly. Yeah. I mean, it's a pretty cool gun. I mean, you can use it whenever you want. That's why this glitch is super cool. You never know what you could come up with. And you can do some outrageous stuff. Like if you have a, a mini nuke um, with an MRV, you could put that MRV on a, a 10 millimeter pistol and make it automatic and you could for some reason, I don't know, something like that. But because I don't have level 4 on all of my stuff, I can't get the MRV yet. So I'll show you that it works, that it's compatible with the uh, millies as well. You can also use 1 and 2, which I think is really helpful. And let's quick save. And I did not discover this glitch on my own. Um, a YouTuber by the name of Hey I'm Starlord showed me this glitch. And I'm happy about it because now I get to tell y'all. There we go. We can put... See, it's, it's really cool what you can do with this stuff. Use your creative skills to the to, to the limit. Oh, wow. That does not look stupid at all. Uh, let me go back to the save and let me do it the other way around. I don't want to save, I want to go back to the other save. 
For some reason, I got so many accounts on Fallout. But, uh, you never know. You never know. Let me do it the other way around now. I want to name that two and name this one. See how this goes. Now we have a sword on the end <laughs> of her punching silly things. Imagine punching somebody with this. That's like. How does it even work? Okay, now I'm gonna show you how to burrow thing. Okay, so that's what these two guns. And my PlayStation is getting loud again. You name this one, because I can't scrap. Oh, wait a minute. I can't scrap legendary stuff, so that's gonna be two. I don't know why it keeps automatically going up to the X. I'm so upset about that. There we go. You have to one. Because I want to put the barrel of this to this. So, let's do that. Oh. Oh, wait, I did it. Yeah, I did it right. I didn't click down. Okay, so yeah, why not? I do want to put the... No, I don't want to put the... Alright. I wanted to put the barrel on it. So let's go back. Okay. Oh wow, I didn't quick save it, did I? Well, that's an all-time low. I'll just grab these two. Drop these two. Let's do this again. You're number one. And you're number two. There we go. Let's quick save this time. Okay. Now what you want to do is you click square and X. That's on PlayStation, but on Xbox it should be X and A. Yeah, X and A on Xbox. And then the D-pad down. So let's do this. No. Nope. 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 No. Wait a minute. It, it went down, but it didn't go to the burrow, so... That's not what we want. No. See, like, it goes down, like, what I want it to do, but it doesn't go to what I need. Nope. Let's try, let's try like this. Let me... No. Maybe it's simpler than it is. Maybe I'm just clicking it too fast. Maybe if I click down and then this? Nope. Nope. Uh, no. I don't want this. I don't want the barrel. I want to switch the barrel. No! How did that even happen? Okay. Well, you you you, uh, you guys can test that. I mean, it's it's not working for me. I'm upset about it. But you guys can test it if y'all want to. Cause I swear this worked on somebody else. Oh, hey, I'm Star Lord. I mean, he can do the barrel thing, but there's other people that actually were able to do the barrel, change the barrel to something different, which. I'm not seeing, because I cannot do this. I cannot hit the pearl. Okay, let me try with the analog. Uh, the moment it goes down to the barrel, I forget to click the scrap. So analog seems to be working better. Yes! I got it, I got it, I got it. So now you click scrap. And improve. Did I actually get- Yes! I did it! I did it! Everybody praise me. Should I get this type of world or this type of world? I like the way this looks, but I like the way this looks better because it actually has a guard around it. But you know. We gangsters. 
actually have full stock on that. Let me let me get a, a, a disc because it actually looks like it's going on it. Oh, no, no, let's just keep it like that. Oh, I did it! I did it. So yeah, y'all saw it. It actually works. Oh. Oh, um. I um apparently can't shoot it. Um. 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 Okay, well, yeah, I saw that it works, and don't. I'll be doing more glitches tomorrow. Um, but this is. Yeah, this does not work. Oh wait. Oh, I'm able to shoot it when I'm in third person. Okay, so if you ever have a gun that actually looks like this and the dude's gonna wanna punch with it, then just go in third person. It works in third person. Okay, there we go. Yay. Okay. I hope this glitch helped anybody. Um, to, um, just subscribe and, and, and share this video with your friends, because glitches are awesome, especially for Fallout. Because we don't have mods yet, and I think this glitch really helps. I mean, because there's actually a mod, any uh, weapon, any mod, any weapon, any, any mod, any weapon thing, whatever it's called. But there's actually a mod for it, and there's no mods on PlayStation, and it's really cool how you're able to do it with a glitch. So, yeah, don't forget to check out Hey, I'm Star-Lord, because he showed us this glitch. So, yeah. See ya.